Yeah, he'll stop a short distance from you. And that's what you want. I'm gonna unmute just so I can hear Yes, we did it. Freaking bastard. Take that. And run. And we are running too. And that makes sense. So oh, we have, have more than one. Everything. Do we need like uh, the tools, simple tools? No, right? We don't, nope, need... we don't need anything that you don't have on, yeah, apart from, well, everything else we need we can get when we get there. All right, we just need the weather to be cooperating and warm. It's not going to be warm because it's early. But no, warm is be... not, but... Oh, are you still carrying your lantern on you? Yes. We don't need that. All right. Do we take the fish too? I'm going to have to leave something behind. Uh, no, we are smelling. Take... We are smelling if we do that. So... Yeah, no, I would take the... Oh, that piece of rabbit. There it is. Uh, and yeah. I need to drink. I would I take forgot. the rabbit. Yeah, definitely don't take the fish. The fish stink. Yeah, let me go up, uh, get the a little bit more water because I had to drink. I forgot to do that. And let me get like... Oh, uh, yeah. I forgot to drink first. I uh, just said one more liter. I'd say it's cold anyway. We can hold off for a little bit before we head out. Yeah. All right. Hello. Yeah, I don't know. If we head out now, we'll be in the boxcar right around the time you start freezing really bad. Yeah, we are smelling one, so maybe I can leave one of the of the fish. I guess both of the fish, because uh, they both smell. <laughs> well, the one good thing is there is a fair amount of food in Forlorn Muskeg in the Spence homestead once you break the crates open. There'll yeah. be two or three cans of dog food and some other stuff. Plus, you're going to get a lot of cattails on the way. Oh, speaking of food, I see that deer up on the hill. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> damn it. We'll be back for you with a bow and arrow soon, Mr. Man. All Coming right, for you. I'm going in. I'm not pausing, but I'm, I'm just standing there to pass a little bit of time and, and gain back the, the, the temperature, maybe wait for the weather or something. Yeah, I'd, I would definitely wait a couple hours at least and see if it warms up at all. If we can get it down to two, two arrows down, that's probably worth traveling in. Okay. Like I said... If you go out the back door, especially, it's a. We'll just make it a little bit shorter trip. We'll aim for the tunnel and we'll see how we're doing, because we can have a fire in there if we have to. Do we have fire stuff? You have some sticks and things on you. Yeah? I have um, just a few sticks. That's the only okay, thing. Okay, well we can we can pick sticks up on on the way, and okay. if we have to, we can set fire to something or even just put the bedroll down and rest for a minute or pass time for a minute as long as we can get it somewhere in the neighborhood of where we need to be. Maybe I I can sleep for one hour here to pass time a little bit. Uh, yeah, you might as well. You you didn't get a full night's sleep. You were really exhausted when you went to bed. That'll kill some time. Let me eat one, um... I know we are just courting a blizzard. That's... <laughs> <laughs> but, at least it's not going to hit us out in the middle of four on muskeg somewhere. I'm so used to, to having the cat tails. They're running out, though. Oh, yeah. They're running out. But We're going to get a lot more in the very near future. I'm pretty sure you're going to pick up a couple dozen probably before we get to the um, Spence homestead. All right. So let's see how we are. Well, it's uh, right. it's only two down now. Okay, just to be clear, this is going to the rail and to the to the left, right? We go through the tunnel. Yep. Perfect. Railing left tunnel. And if it's really, really crappy when we get there and foggy, we'll just follow the railway and go around the back way. It's a little bit longer, but you can't get lost. Or I can't get lost, so if we're together, we won't get lost. <laughs> so we have a plan and a backup plan. And be sure to pick up any sticks you see that are laying around loose, because we're going to want at least a few more on us. Perfect. All right, here we, we go. Off. Here we oh, go. crap. Crap. <laughs> I'm not happy about this, but it needs to be done. Ah. That's the thing from the James Bond movie. There's no point in living if you can't feel alive. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah, and we know there's a wolf in this neighborhood somewhere, so hopefully we can avoid him. Okay, I'm not hearing him. Ah. That's good. I didn't check. Do we have any more flares on us at all? I have no idea. Gotta eat soon. Nope. Uh, and I'm, I'm right. taking the the freaking thingy. The I, if I didn't we don't have a flare, hold the torch in your hands. Okay. Oh, she says we don't have a torch either. Okay. Well, uh, hey, this is starting well. 
<laughs> there won't be a flare in the railroad car. We just have to get to the railroad car. No, we'll just have to wing it. We have the um, uh, the flare gun. I was saying, we got a couple baits and the flare gun. Yeah, we should be fine. So, and I did bring the um, uh, the lantern with me, so uh, right, we well, can equip, leave equip it. Equip the flare gun and make sure it's loaded. All right. I'm pretty sure we did reload it last time, but yeah, better safe than sorry. Uh, reload has okay. Yeah, it's one. It has one of the cool. I don't know how many shells you have on you. But only one. Only. Oh yes. Damn. That sounded like you just got a sprain. Yes, I, I always always get scared when it's like all of a sudden boom. As long as it was your ankle, not your arm, it was. All right, we can bandage it in the tunnel if you want. If you can't stand the wobblies, I know it makes you um, ill. <laughs> oh yeah, we'll bandage him up in the tunnel. There'll be, there should be, I won't say there will be, but there should be something in the boxcar that we can tear up and make a bandage out of as well. There's almost always one crappy, crappy, crappy piece of clothing and a couple pieces ah. of coal. You can hit reload again and pray we have one more shell somewhere. <laughs> and if you don't, well, we'll have to wing it. That's gonna slow things down. Yeah, you can even go down lower if you want. Oh, yeah. Yes. We did it right. We did it right. We don't... Ah, oh, we have a shell. We have a shell. Yes. Awesome. We didn't have only one. We have, uh, now it's, it's it's rolling again. Bastard. Yeah, now we have... Now we have none. There you are. Ah, really? He came up behind us? <laughs> okay, we don't have anything else, so we just might as well holster yep. the gun. And there we are. I think we are safe. Let's just see if we can Well, that's, this is really starting well. <laughs> <laughs> we are using our, all of our resources. They're trying to drain our defenses before we get anywhere near the mother load here. Or the mothership, I think, was the... Uh, it's a quote from a science fiction movie, and I've just completely lost the film and the quote, so that's okay. fine. <laughs> Leave Mystery Lake, and we are cold already. Is, what is, what's the old Japanese thing, the death of a thousand cuts, where <laughs> they just keep <laughs> nicking you to pieces until you bleed to death? Can I bandage myself the right foot? Yes. Applying the bandages there and uh, can i do the other one because okay I and eat a cattail because we are starting to lose health makes sense just the one if you have to but oh yeah both sprained ankles we probably want the ability to run so i would consider this an investment in impossible or having a future all right <laughs> you can live with the pain but yeah being able to run is probably key here especially cool. before we go out on the thin ice and there is crap around behind the box car but we will worry about that when we get there and see how crowded it is with animals Makes sense. Because there's a, there's probably not a whole lot out there now anyway, but it's, I mean, it's always worth a look, so. Used to be, I don't know if it still is, but it used to be, you could actually climb up on top of the box car and hunt the bear from there. Ah. There's a, a I've never done log that. or something you can climb up on top, but, well, we don't have anything to hunt it with anyway, so it's kind of moot at the moment. But. Yeah, we're going to hope this fog goes away here so we can see our way across the ice. Is. I'm good, but I don't know if I could get you all the way across the ice in the dead fog. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not... I can, I'm... Get you to, I can get you to Spence, but we have to go the long way. Yeah, don't wander too far from the tracks, because the wolves skirt the sides of it. All right. They tend to... I always walk right down the middle if I can, because they tend to be somewhere to one side or the other. And I know in Stalker, it's three wolves on one side and two on the other. And the bear will be, usually the bear is on the right, but I have seen him on the left on rare occasions. In fact, the last time you came through on Stalker, the bear was on the left side when you got to the boxcar. It was a bear oh, on the left side. Someone is barking. And, and I don't see it. Ah, there he is, there it is. I'm going to just run over as long there. As, not, as long as he's not in front of you. No, it's not. It's, it's one side, so I'm running. And Run like uh, hell for the boxcar, then. Yeah, continue running through the... The rail tracks and um, you're almost at the box car. I'm so. almost there. So we have the again, hammer with us. I would say, if attacked, 
Very calmly select the hammer and then beat his skull in. Can you eat trees? The attack won't last long. I really don't want to get attacked because we can't afford the hit for well the damage or the clothing at the moment. Okay, we are at the at the train wreck, so shall you'll we have find? to call this you'll have to call this episode either bad omens or ominous beginnings. <laughs> <laughs> Because as far as trips go, this has not been... I mean, if you were doing this as a like a vacation, you'd have turned around and gone home already. Oh, <laughs> like, there we nope, go. Nope, nope, nope. Nobody wants me to do this. Nice. Alright, now we can at least hide out in there. There's a piece of coal we definitely want. Alright, you already picked that up. Ah, yes, the delay. Okay, we're in. We're in better shape. The problem is... Oh, good, a pistol book. Can we craft... We can craft a torch with our bare hands, so let's just do that. Yeah, just watch your um, health. Eat a cattail before you do anything because you are ah, already losing right. health quite bad. You're right. Uh, In fact, this might be a good time to drink the birch bark tea. All right, let's do that. Because you've got uh, that crappy vest on the ground, we can rip that up for bandages reishi, later. Reishi. Where is that? What? What It'll that? Be drink. Okay, drinks. What? What does that thing do? It uh, does the same thing for you while you're awake that the tea does for you while you're sleeping. It gives ah. you a health, health boost to pick your health back okay, up. Okay, I'm drinking that. And 110 calories, nice. Cool. Ah, restore condition. That's cool. Yeah, I think it'll I'm... restore your condition while you're awake. I'm going to get Which... that, um, that stick. And maybe there are a few more. We are actually using it to um, not restore condition so much as to limit the loss of condition. That totally makes oh, you... sense. You didn't pick up the vest in the boxcar either. No. I just if you get enough sticks, we can make a small fire and sit there and do something until the... Uh, like you yeah. can take your torches and stuff and that we can warm up a little bit before we go and hopefully the fog will clear. You can at least, if nothing else, if you can get the fire warm enough, you can tear up that vest and craft bandages while you're sitting there. And you might as well take the small arms book on the floor of the thing if you haven't used it yet and use that to start the fire. There we are. The downside of being 10 seconds behind. This is like the old days. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. I knocked my mic Well, if the, if the fire fails, you can go pick the small gun, the handgun book up and use that to start it. It's sitting Lord. there and it's useless for anything else but. So. We are fine. There we are. Of course we're fine. We're good at this, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Yeah, just don't to... add the coal. Save the coal for all it's worth. Just stay close to this. Um, let's just put a little bit more of these sticks, right? Yeah, a couple of sticks don't burn very long, but they generate a pretty good chunk of heat. So. I hear someone moving around the, <laughs> the yeah, train that'll car. Be the wolf. That'll be the wolf walking around outside the car. Which is another really good reason for us to stand here for a little while. Okay, let's just put a little bit more uh, sticks so we can increase. We don't have much though. Because the temperature is not going up. Now it's 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 going up. Nine. I was Nine say, you degrees. can always um well it's too late now you figured it out. You can always check your feels like and see how close it is to like four or five degrees and put your bedroll down and we could have just rested for an hour in front of it. Because ah, you get okay. the bedroll bonus for the extra heat. So if your fire is not quite good enough, you can use your bedroll for the extra. But yeah, I'd say we rip the vest up and make a couple more bandages because you're down to four already. All right, that makes sense. And we got an hour and 31, and that'll warm you up some. And hopefully the fog goes away and we can just go. Oh, shoot. Sorry about that. That's yeah, my phone. No I always forget to turn it down. Okay. Okay, yeah, my son was going to come over for dinner tonight, but he's not because his girlfriend's not feeling good. Oh. This is one of my favorite, my scrambled eggs, the one thing I know how to cook really bloody well. <laughs> I make the best scrambled eggs on the planet. Nice. It, my grandfather taught me, and it was his mother's recipe. That's cool. So it's a couple hundred years of knowledge goes into it. <laughs> 
I don't have oh, to cook man. the bacon. Somebody else gets to do that. I just have to cook eggs. That's my one and only nice, job. Nice, nice, bacon. nice, nice, nice. <laughs> uh, bacon's been on sale for the last week or so, so I've been buying bacon and sticking it in the freezer. Cool. All right, 29 minutes remaining of the of the fire. We are going to stay as much. Okay, I was possible. texting my I was texting my son, so I have no idea what you I'm looking. Rip up the vest. I rip up the vest. I created um, two more bandages. Now we have six okay, back again. Then pull a pull a torch or two out before you lose the um, thing, the and fire. That totally makes sense. We have one there. Cool. If you can get three, that'll be perfect. Because I suspect it's getting really foggy. We're going to have to follow the tracks. It's we only... can do that with a lit torch in our yeah. hands. I have a lit torch in my hands now. So, but um, right. that's as much as we can you get. You just have to get there. Okay, it's going to be you can, um, the you ice. You can cheat and use your map, and I won't tell anybody. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you have a map of Forlorn Muskeg somewhere. I see the okay, bear. There. Hello, bear. Oh, that's a great start. <sighs> yes, he's going to be right where we need to go. Isn't oh, no, he said, okay. He's out on where the tracks were, so I yeah. don't oh, know. Wait a minute. It's on the tracks. Okay, yes. If we'd followed the railroad tracks, that would have gone horribly, horribly wrong. So, yep. So. We follow the the snow. Yep. Stay on the snow and listen for the creaking of ice. I can't hear it, so. Okay. And you might as well leave the torch burning, but I wouldn't light the second one from it. This is just to get us out of any wolves that might be around here right now. Ah, okay. Okay, so we, we... can always waste the match if we have to and light it again out on the out on the ice if we need to. Hopefully we don't need to. So inventory. We go to tools, right? This yep. one I drop, that one I use, and then I. It's burned out. Freaking bastard! <laughs> oh, son of a bitch. Alright, well, don't light the new one until we need it. I, we need it. <laughs> we need oh, it. Oh, okay. Good to know. Well, if we need it, we need it. Light her up. Uh, yep, yeah, this is really, really boding well. We are going back to the other side then, to the other way. Yes. If it doesn't, we will probably get attacked, but he'll be gone then, too, so that works. Either way, we're getting rid of him. We need to go across the middle of this, and he's in the damn way. So, yeah, just let Makes him sense. come to you, and then he will... Makes sense. He will okay, stop. He'll stop and growl at you. Yep. Uh, just keep your eye on him, though. <laughs> ah, great. We're down to about 70% health. Yeah, he'll stop a short distance from you, and that's what you want. I'm going to unmute just so I can hear this. Yes, we did it. Freaking bastard. Take that and run. And we are running too. We are yeah. running towards okay. where you were. Freaking Jesus. It worked. Oh. Yep, there we go. Okay, you aimed a little short too, so yes. if it happens again, aim a little higher. But yeah, that's the idea. Okay. This is a technique we've been avoid using, and I think we're going to start using it more. <laughs> totally makes <laughs> sense. We are getting bullied, and I'm tired of it. <laughs> <laughs> They've had their way with us for long enough, god damn it. There we yeah, go. now we can resume the trip. Okay, there we are. I do know there is a ridiculously tricky spot somewhere after this where we are. I don't remember where it is, but there is an awful... One really bad spot we have to kind of maneuver around a little bit, okay. but then we're okay. We'll find out in a second how, how good my if... grasp of geography is. Yeah, it seems I th I see what it is, but let me let me go like this. Yeah, and I see some stuff. Yeah, that's another part. There's uh, a fallen tree over here. And that's probably the tricky part I remembered. Yeah, just get the, get on the other side of those rocks in the middle of that island in front of you, and hopefully we can do this. I'm not getting the cattails now. It's, uh, I don't feel like spending time. <laughs> no, it's fine. Like I said, there's quite a bit of food there. We should be all right. Um, when we get there, if we get there, we'll worry about it. I think, I want to say this, those rocks look like they have a little cave in between them. And I want to say there's like a little camp in there. I know there might be in Stalker. I, again, my time spent in the middle of this island is very, 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 very Scamp. limited. <laughs> yeah, extremely limited. But I have gone exploring around yeah. through it. 
There we are. I see the kind of the the wooden fences now put in a boss, so So I was right, it was at two o'clock. Ha, I got it correct. Okay. All we gotta do is get there. <sighs> God, I hate Wild Cross 4 for this game. <laughs> Still it's nice, at least this hasn't been a boring episode. No, this is this is really really fun. We do need to get you we need to get you in and healing for Oh, eat a cattail. Jesus, you're taking a double health hit. Oh, you're right. You're probably gonna yeah. get hypothermia too, but all we gotta do is get there. We'll be okay. Yeah, we gotta slow the damage, but you can have a tea when you go to bed and that will help make a big difference, I think. We're gonna have three or four days out here to heal, so this should be okay. Yeah, this wolves love that little um, selection of cabins, so keep an ear out for them where you're headed All for right. those. And then you have to go across the dock to the spence. Oh, I saw a sapling. I think. Yep, I see a sapling. Oh, oh yes, I see them. Not the wolves? No, the saplings. <laughs> oh, yeah, I was going to say the oh, saplings yeah. I saw, but they kept blurring out in your pain vision, so. Yeah. It is there. Right. Yep, there they are. Right. We will just, let's get to Spence, and then we will worry about everything after that. Can't we go through here? Please. You can follow the side of the bridge and you won't fall in the water. Ah, okay. <clears throat> uh, yep, yeah. barring anything horrible, I think we're going to make it. I really hope so, because if you get attacked right now, we're screwed. You only got 50% health right now. <laughs> Alright, I don't hear anything. Let's hope. The torch is, um, is there, but it's uh, it's almost out. That's fine. So hungry. If you can pick up enough reclaimed wood and sticks and shit in the yard just to make a quick small fire to warm up, that would be good too. Awesome. Get it warm while we poke around in here and find some stuff. Alright. That was unpleasant. <laughs> Alright. There we are, freaking Jesus Christ, there. Cool. Okay. Yeah. Ugh. Um. Ah! Uh. I heard something. I don't something. know why you're uh, being... <laughs> It's okay, wolves, wolves will not come in the barn after you. Alright, there's, uh, they there's some, in away. some coal and stuff. Yep, save okay. the coal for sure. Perfect. I cannot. Yeah. I'm on the top, so it's um. They know they don't go inside, right? <laughs> I can. I was gonna I, say. Look at the bed and see what the temperature feels like and what the um, um, thing right. is. Maybe we can just take a nap for an hour and get get you warmed um, up a little bit. Feels like zero bed warmth bonus plus five, so we can. Okay. Rest in the bed. Feels like one. So maybe one hour? Yep. Don't let do me, more than a couple. Yeah. Let me, let me get uh, one cattail before we do that. And um, we do... Yep, and that will start That will start the healing process. One. Oh, freezing. now it feels like one, so you're actually yeah. starting to warm up anyway, but this will warm you up quicker. Let's see now. Let's see if we went. Ah, and it dropped to two. Still good. Yeah, it's good. It's good. We are a little bit better there um okay yeah, we'll stop the bleeding jesus christ that was a rough ride <laughs> <laughs> how are That's we okay. doing now um you're only so... losing temp a little bit and it should start warming up again a few so start exploring and see what's there see what you can find okay and if it gets nice and warm we'll start busting up the crates where the food is perfect let me okay let's just uh, start ex getting stuff from here and uh, before we we turn off turn on the first aid oh i saw a nice big jacket i don't know if it's a warm jacket or not there's a jacket down on the toolbox 
Yeah. I can't tell if it's a ski jacket or not. Or ski jacket, yes. Check the temperature on it. Maybe it's warmer than what we're wearing. And we can wear it um, on top of everything, so we don't have to ah, take bonus anything. Points. Bonus, there we are. It's Extra just heat. Going down any further. There we are. Oh, looting. Looting again. <laughs> Yay. It's been a while. That's small scrap metal, I was a boss. Q got nice. Thanks so much for oh, Thank game. You very much, game. Oh, we didn't get a blizzard at least, so that went well. <laughs> One of the few things it did, but hey. It matches. Worked. This match is always here, right? Uh, I think so, yeah. I don't remember if it's a guaranteed spawn to have them in here somewhere, but yeah, you pretty much always get matches over here. Uh, let's just go inside here. Can we? Yes. Yeah, there's a safe behind the boxes. Nice. There's also that. stuff out behind the barn, but you can wait till tomorrow to go get that where there's probably wolves and stuff still prowling around in the yard. So we should there be... should be a lot of wood. Oh, uh, a lot. There's a couple ooh. pieces. Dog food, my favorite thing in the world. Hey, I don't know how many cans we got, but that's 500 <laughs> calories each, though. So. Two. All right. We break the crates, okay. right? Because we, we will need this. Yeah. But, um, oh yeah, you're starting to warm up, so now's a really good time to bust the crates up. Feel free to use the hammer. Oh, okay. Just for the, just to make it faster, because the weather's pretty, you're right on the cusp of where it's going to be too hot, too cold. Okay. You might as well just... just save the time. Feels like a lot of gear. The hammer's in pretty good shape, and you're not going to do that much damage to it doing the, um, yeah, see, temp went down. I did it by, by hand, but... I'm starting with the... Maybe I should I should do the the um, the safe when when we turn on the the other stuff right the oh safe you're already on the safe on my screen you're starting to do it no but but it's just I just uh, stopped yeah, because if you of break up the yeah break up the big oh actually go back up and either pass time or sleep for an hour I'd pass time probably we should be all right and uh, just warm up enough to be able to bust the crate up. It's time of day. The temp should be getting slightly warmer than it is. Okay. Let me let me. Oh, have... my cake is such a miserable place. You never know. <laughs> let me have one of this and sleep for one hour. So we do this. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we'll do what we can while it's warm. Yeah, this is supposed to be the warmest time of the day, and it's not even remotely. It could just be a really freaking cold day. Yeah. No. Temperature is okay. Yeah, okay. Too. We'll get your tent back up, and then we can go down and break up the big crate. And I think that it's one of those two down there should have some food in it. Okay. There'll be a crate gonna... either upstairs or down. One of the crates will have like um, accelerant in it, and the other crate will have food. All right. So I don't good. know if it's, if it's accelerant downstairs and food up, or if it's food downstairs and accelerant up. But it's, it's right there should be one. food and accelerant in here somewhere. This one is not. Except yeah. We go back. Probably the little one, since I told you to break up the big one. <laughs> just Let's just get uh, back again in the in the bed and get the, yep. pass, the pass another hour, and we'll go back and do it again. You're wide awake, so you might as well just use the like pass time for it. Oh, there we are. Pass time. There. Hate to do it, but we might have to have a fire for like four or five hours just so you can get a nice big chunk of sleep because if you do two and two like you're supposed to when it's cold yeah uh, you're not going to heal up very much uh requires light to break so we are not um yeah we cannot break anything else okay now. we're done so uh, we should turn on the starvation. this thing now right yeah. have plenty of uh of wood but we will need the furnace I think, right? Let's say we'll we'll hold off on the fire for now. We'll try sleep in two hours, two hours, two hours. But drink okay. a tea first. You might as well get a little bit of health kick out of it. Makes sense. Eat what you're going to eat for food, and then we'll have the tea as part of the calories. Die. If yeah, if you sleep like one or two hours at a go, even if it gets really brutally cold, you at least won't get frostbite and die. Makes sense. The um, uh, the herbal tea, right? Do what? The oh, yeah, the herbal her tea. The, the herbal All right. tea. All right. I couldn't hear you. I was scratching my yeah. head. <laughs> <laughs> um, no problem. Uh, so we have uh, one bunny and dog food. Dog food is 28% and 27%. So, should uh, we? I, yeah, I'd be a bit. Uh, Let's just hold. 
Man, I don't know. Yeah, do the bunny, do the cattail, do the tea. However it takes to get to... Well, actually, yeah, you don't have to... You might as well get all the calories. Yeah, I do the rabbit, the tea, and then cattails. Have a drink, and then... Um, be sure, before you hit sleep, to see your feels-like temperature versus the bed's temperature. And make sure okay. you're going to be in a positive number. 500, so let's just get two of these cattails. If it gets too cold, we'll start a fire for a few hours, and then we'll worry about it after that. Oh, no. We'll try and save the wood in the fire for as long as possible. Alright, makes sense. 